Hi, I'm Steve Lasker. In this quick video, I want to show you how you can easily deploy Docker images from the Azure Container Registry to the newly announced Azure Container Instances. If I come to the Azure portal and go to the Azure Container Registries blade, I can choose to create a new one and push my images using standard Docker commands. And once done, you could click on that registry, browse to the collection of images, which we call repositories, and within this, I can see I have a demos ASP.NET Hello World with both Linux and Windows tags. And I need to choose the specific tag of which I can then either create a webhook and delete, or I could actually run an instance of it. This lets me very easily create an instance of my image that I've selected and for testing, or maybe I'm just using it for deployment. I'll do the standard Azure things for creating a resource group and giving it a unique name. And everything else is fine. I'll accept the defaults. Azure will now go off and provision that container as a resource. I don't have to actually deploy a VM or orchestrator to be able to run this image. Uh, so while that's coming up, I can bring up Cloud Console. And we can say AZ container list within the resource group Steve Lass ACI and we can see that that resource is being deployed and here's my fully qualified image name. Now that that's deployed and we run that command again we can see that it succeeded and now I can just take the IP address because I did tell it to make a public port and if I just paste and go we'll be able to see my image running in up in Azure. So here's a standard ASP.NET website and about, uh, I edited this page to spit out a bunch of environment variables and you can see a bunch of interesting information around how the container is running. To go back and delete this, because I'm paying for the minute for my Azure container instances, I can say AZ container delete the resource group, or actually the name, sorry. Actually, I do need to give it the group. Steve Lass ACI dash name, Steve Lass ACI as well. And now that will actually delete that individual image. So uh, if we go back and um, take a look, uh, AZ container list, we can see that there is no longer anything running. Uh, so that quickly, I was able to take an image from the Azure Container Registry, deploy to Azure Container Instances, test my image, have it build just for the amount of time that that image is running, see my image running using the public port that was made available to me, delete it, and now I'm done. Uh, for more information, you can look up the uh, information around the Azure Container Registry, including our docs, uh, as well as other presentations I have available in my GitHub account. Thank you very much for watching.